Chris, yes, ladies and gentlemen, good, e uh, good evening. And what an absolute pleasure it is for me to be here to join with you in celebrating uh, Women's History Month. It's truly a pleasure. A few years ago, I guess it was actually about 10 years ago, uh, there was an article in the National Post entitled, How Women Won the West. It was about the fight in the early 1900s for single women to gain the right to become independent farmers and to own their own homesteads like their counterparts in the United States. The article included a full half-page historic photo of a woman complete with cowboy boots, long skirt, cowboy hat, atop a horse that looked like it had seen much better days. There was also a photo of a woman outfitted in her bonnet and long dress, seated behind her horse-drawn plow. Now these were eye-catching photos in an interesting article about Canadian women who were, by every sense of the term, trailblazers.